Hello everyone, welcome back to Tutor ABC's Movie Notes. I'm Alan, and today we're going to be introducing another superhero film. Uh, it's from Marvel Comics, and it's called Ant-Man. So, from the name, we kind of have an idea of uh, what this story might be a little bit like. But let's take a look at the trailer, and then we'll come back and talk about some of the words and phrases. Imagine a soldier the size of an insect. The ultimate secret weapon. If you give godlike powers to everyone, it's going to be chaos. So how do we stop him? By knowing I. Scott, I've been watching you for a while. You're different. And I believe everyone deserves a shot at redemption. Do you? Absolutely. My days of breaking into places and stealing stuff are over. What do you want me to do? I want you to break into a place and steal some stuff. Makes sense. Are you ready to become the hero? Now, the suit has power. You have to learn how to control it. And these are your greatest allies. You're kind of cute. Whoa. When you're small, you have superhuman strength. You like a bullet. So you need to know how to punch. You want to show me how to punch? Show me how to punch. That's how you punch. to hide your suit from me. Now, it's gonna blow up in your face and destroy everyone you care about. Scott, get out of there! Did you think you could stop the future? You're just a thief! No. I'm Ant-Man. I know. It wasn't my idea. So the first of these four phrases and words that we're going to talk about is the word redemption. Uh, now this word kind of has a, uh, an abstract or very deep meaning, but it just means uh, to, to be saved maybe from a bad situation or from evil, or to get something back that you lost, maybe repaying a debt or something, getting back to a good situation or a good condition. So redemption is kind of a theme in this movie. Along with that, the main character says that my days of something something are over. So if you say my days of this are over, what does that mean? Well, the phrase my days just means the time that I did something. So you could say my days of tests and homework are over, which means that you're done with school. So here he's talking about his criminal activity. He says my days of doing that are over. He's, he's moved on or he's stopped that. So that's what that means. Now, in the next scene that we see, he says, makes sense. Now, these two very short words we use in English all the time. But makes sense, you might not understand. That might not make sense. And if you say makes sense, if something makes sense, it just means it's easy to understand, or it has logic, it has uh, good reasoning. It's easy to understand. I see what you mean. So, in English, we say that a lot. If someone explains something, so oh, that, that makes sense, so that, that's logical. So, very small little word, but we use it all the time. And then the last thing uh, that we're going to see in this video is if something blows up in your face. Now, that could be literal, and it could be literal especially in an action film like this, but if something blows up in your face, then it goes very, very badly. Maybe I had a plan for a project or to do something, and I thought it would have this outcome, but instead it has this outcome, and instead of helping me, it harms me. 
I would say that project blew up in my face. It went very bad and it had negative uh, results. So we see that in here and it looks like something might blow up in someone's face in this movie. So those are just a few little phrases that you might not understand that would also be very useful in day-to-day -day life. So that's our movie for now at Tudor ABC's Movie Notes. Check us out on Facebook and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.